What's up? How are you guys this week? Just wanted to show you a quick new meal that I've been doing that kind of follows the same principles I've been adhering to in my recovery from eight years on the carnivore diet. High carbohydrate, high starch, high gut motility, minimal inflammation, lean beef is the main source of animal protein and just really trying to keep the gut very healthy, keep things moving and I mean, now this is based on almost two years of me following this, this new type of protocol. So we're just going to take a look at this meal. And if you guys aren't 100% familiar, uh, I took a drug called Accutane, which kind of messed me up a little bit. And then the carnivore diet seemed to be okay. But, you know, five, six years into it, it started getting worse and worse and worse. And then I spent about two years on that carnivore diet, just getting really, really bad. So, you know, my take another year or two or three to get better, which is kind of being impeded by me working so much on YouTube and on my business, but you know, you can't, you can't have everything. So I'm um, like United Nations, you know, we had the Italian boy deli diet. Um, today we have the Japanese udon style meal and uh, maybe we'll go good old American with the, the, the sausage and pancakes or what is that British? Is that more British anyway? Everything here is organic. Everything here is high quality. Uh, so I grilled up some hanger steak from Frankie's Sea Range Meat, which is one of my favorite cuts, really delicious. Just took that out of the fridge uh, from like three days ago on the grill. And I put that with some organic udon noodles. Uh, maybe I'll show you guys them in the recipe I do next Saturday on a high quality udon recipe. I have some organic sauteed shiitake mushrooms. Didn't put anything on them because I want you know the mushroom flavor to be separate and to really go through put a little coconut aminos as the soy sauce on top. And in the bottom, the broth is the, the collagen stock that we have on Frankie's Shoe Range Meat, but I reinforced it with a lot of meat for some more B vitamins, a little bit of onion, a little bit of garlic. So this is super delicious, super flavorful, minimally inflammatory. I actually went to get udon at a, at a restaurant when I didn't have access to the kitchen last week. And you know, when you eat this stuff in, in these restaurants, it's not organic, it's not the highest quality, it tastes good, but you know they're putting stuff in there that you really shouldn't eat, like vegetable seed oils and all, all types of crap, chemicals and powders you don't really know. So this is a nice way to have something that's just about as delicious. Um, and, and this isn't the, the recipe I'm going to show you guys. It's going to take a little more effort than this, uh, but this is just something quick that I whipped together that tastes good enough that I like it. And, you know, it's, it's nice because I'm not, you know, beans, rice, meat, all separate. It's nice. It's one bowl. It's not too much work. It's pretty fast. Those organic udon noodles are, are really, really quick to cook. And the reason I stopped the pasta is because there's certain anti-nutrients and chemicals in the type of wheat that's used in that pasta. But this udon that I found is actually really good. I like that I have noodles now that I can have. We're going to have the water kefir grains, of course. Uh, water kefir I'm kind of on and off with. Uh, masticum as usual. And then for dessert, we have some apples peeled and our organic rice crisp bar uh, from Frankie's True Range Foods. Uh, so we're just going to do a quick overview of the meal and then I'm just going to sit down and enjoy it guys. So the lean beef is just high quality protein, amino acids, B vitamins, really for the cellular health. And something people overlook a lot is even very lean beef like this uh, that looks lean still has very high fat and cholesterol content. So you are getting all of those healthy fats for your cellular health. And there's also so many B vitamins and the other contrasting amino acids in that collagen broth that we have on Frankie's Tree Range Meat. The mushrooms, I really just add them for flavor, but it's also kind of added gut motility, some minerals. Uh, the udon is the bulk of the starch and the carbs to feed our gut bacteria, keep things moving, detox the liver with the starch, give things to soak into. This is basically just probiotic culture in the kefir grains that replaces what we're missing because when your liver dysfunctions and you have organ damage, um, candida overgrows because of the toxins coming out of the liver. It's like a defensive mechanism. So this helps keep it in check a little bit. Same with the masticum. And yes, guys, my liver is still bad enough that I will get candida if I don't take this stuff or if I eat too much sugar or deviate from the diet a little bit. The apple, same principle, very high water, more gut motility, feeding the gut bacteria. And then the organic rice crisp bar, or when I have the cookie bars, I just need caloric density, guys, because I, I lose weight really easily. Um, even these aren't enough. You know, then tomorrow or the next day, I'll have to eat like sandwiches and the cookie bars to make up because 
this might seem like it's not, um, I mean, I guess it really is just really high quality whole organic foods. Uh, so it's not like calorically dense enough for someone that used to work out and was into bodybuilding and stuff, but it's, it's, it's okay enough for maintaining and I feel good and I usually sleep pretty good eating this. So you guys can go to frankiesurangemeat.com, frankiesurangefoods.com, organ supplements, check out all the interesting products and learn a little bit more about what I'm taking here. Uh, maybe we'll do an updated supplement video in, in a week or two, but I think that's going to be everything. So I uh, hope you guys are eating healthy and feeling good too. As usual, please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. I wanted to do something longer and show you guys all three meals, but with everything going on, the current living situation, I'm just, I, I, just, I just can't do it. I really can't. Um, but hopefully things get a little better over the next few weeks and I can get a little more on schedule and, and keep you guys entertained and uh, keep providing you guys with the high quality products.